إثباتُ القدم. You know, we say وثبت أقدامنا وانصرنا على القوم الكافرين. Plant our feet firm. Well, you'll become firm in your beliefs and firm in your in your delivery and your confidence when you develop this relationship with Allah. That's the instruction given to the Prophet ﷺ. وأقوى مقيلا and it's more upright in in terms of speech. In other words, your your words are not filled with distraction of anything else. This is the best time to speak with me. And also some some argue here, wa aqwa muqilan, it's the most upright, it's the best time to be speak in terms of speech with Allah because Allah is where in the middle of, in the last portion of the night. It's the closest. So the best time to talk to me is then. Wa aqwa muqilan. Thabatan wa rusukhan fil ibadah. You disconnect yourself and connect to Allah only. And by doing so, you will help others disconnect themselves and connect to Allah only. You will set the example of how to disconnect others. And, and so it's not just for you. When you become the model of Qiyamul Layl, everyone after you will come in your own following and the billions that will come after you that will want to connect to Allah will now have a legacy. So you're not just doing this for yourself. That's tabtil. If it was just for himself, tabattul ilayhi, tabattul ilayhi, tabattul lazim lazim. It goes lazim muta'addi. Impact yourself, impact others. Subhanallah. Wa tabattal ilayhi tabtila. Now in this, the Prophet ﷺ, first of all, is cutting himself off from society and Allah says, you have a lot of work in the day. This concept is not just with the Prophet ﷺ. Before him, the beautiful example of Musa ﷺ. Such a beautiful conversation in Surah Taha between Allah and Musa ﷺ. I keep talking about it, right? The stick, what's in your hand. Such a beautiful conversation. Why? Because he gets rejuvenated by that conversation. He's got the guilt inside him from a long time ago of killing a person. Allah removes all those scars and tells him, أَنَخْتَرْتُكَ فَاسْتَمِعْ لِبَا يُوحَا Motivates him, bring, brings him close to him. And then, إِذْهَبِ لَا فِرْعَوْنَ Go have the worst conversation of your life. Go. With the nastiest human being on earth. Now that you've had the most beautiful conversation, it's preparing you for the nastiest conversation. That's da'wah. So, cut yourself off from everybody else. Rely on Allah. وَاسْبِرْ عَلَى مَا يَقُولُونَ And be patient over whatever they're saying. وَاحْجُرْهُمْ هَجْرًا جَمِيلًا And abandon them, leave them in the most beautiful way. Don't leave them angry. إِنَّ رَبَّكَ يَعْلَمْ No doubt about it, your master knows. أَنَّكَ تَقُومُ أَدْنَى مِنْ ثُلُثَيِ اللَّيْلِ That you are, you are standing right now, just a little short of a third of a, two thirds of a night. وَنِصْفَهُ or and sometimes a third of, or half of it. وَثُلُثَهُ and a third of it. وَطَائِفَةٌ مِنَ الَّذِينَ مَعَكَ and a group from among those that are with you also do the same. Allah didn't say everybody does it, some people do it too. Some people see the benefit in it too among the Sahaba and they're doing it also. وَاللَّهُ يُقَدِّرُ اللَّيْلَ وَالنَّهَارِ And Allah is the one who calculates and dictates the duration, the span of the night and the day. عَلِمَ أَلَّن تُحْصُوهُ He already knew that you won't be able to keep track of it. And you won't be able to stay on top of it. فَتَابَ عَلَيْكُمْ يعني أن لن تحصوه يعني لن تطيعوا لن تطيقوا ضبط وقت قيامه فتاب عليكم. Then he he accepted your repentance.